Hey, what's going on everyone? Ebaholic here, bringing you a little tutorial, I guess you could say, on how to make your own villagers. Uh, here on the Social Craft server, one of the first projects that I had was building this zombie XP binder. And I said, you know what, I think you can heal these zombie villagers that keep appearing in here. So I looked it up and sure enough found out how to do it. So I thought I'd help you guys out and show you as well. I opened up a piston little trap door there so I could get rid of them. And what I do is I wait here and look for the zombie villagers to spawn. And if they don't, I open them up and dump them in the lava. I don't want to kill them, you know, and get the XP. But we saved the villagers. And I put the iron door there so that I can open it up and let the villagers out. And I let them out, and I walk them out of this room, and I walk them right upstairs. And I just got this mess of blocks here, because I haven't really figured out a great way to do this yet, but uh, capture the zombie villager. And here we go. I hit them with a uh, splash potion of weakness, and then right click on them, the golden apple. And you'll hear a loud noise, and the zombie villager will start to shake violently. Now, from the moment that you defeated the apple, you have to wait three minutes. I don't know go by what that says, but you have to wait three minutes, and boom, the villager will appear, and will be healed, and you will be able to trade with them. Um, there's no telling what it could be, but, um, you know, this is great because all the villagers on this server have been killed uh, by, you know, D-bag kids that, you know, want to be d bag so. Anyways, here is the recipe on how to make the Splash Potion of Weakness. First, you're going to need a fermented spider eye. Second one, you're going to need some redstone. And the third one, gunpowder to turn it into a Splash Potion. So, uh, this is a uh, Brewing 101, I guess. Um, so, uh, and fermented spider eyes are going to be a brown mushroom, um, some sugar, and, oh, and spider eye, and it turns into a fermented spider eye, so, speed this up a little bit, because it does take a little while to brew, but, um, just drop one in there, in that order, the fermented eye, the redstone, and then the gunpowder, and you will have the splash potion of weakness, and then once you have that, you need to make a golden apple, and it's not the you know, enchanted golden apple with the gold blocks. It's just simply a uh, apple with uh, the gold nuggets surrounding it on the crafting bench, in case you were wondering. All right, so I spawned a villager until I got a, you know, zombie villager, and I made sure to trap him. And I'll show you again. We'll hit him with the splash potion of weakness, and then right click on them with the golden apple. So I'm gonna step back here and splash him. And then right click on it. And all you gotta do is wait three minutes. And make sure that they're not out in the sun or around other zombies. And then once it time's up, boop, there you go. There's your own villager. Let's see what he offers. It's probably Yeah. Leather tunic for four emeralds, so not the best guy in the world, but uh, there you go. If you guys like this, please like the video and uh, show your love, and I appreciate it. Thanks, guys. Take care.